hello YouTube welcome back to my video in this video I'm going to show you how you can create a CSV file uh, using Java the CSV stands for comma separated values okay so I will say an example when you want to use I mean uh, what will be a real-time example when you are you want to use the CSV file suppose you want to transfer uh, some data from your MySQL table uh, into an Oracle uh, database table so both are different technologies and different ways of tables even though uh, the, they are SQL tables you might have a uh, uh, you may face some technical difficulties on connecting these uh, to on uh, or transferring this file so the best way to get uh, this uh, uh, file transferred is get a CSV file of your database from from, uh, from your MySQL export it from there and import this CSV file into your Oracle table or Oracle database okay so basically uh, the cross-platform data sharing is actually happen I mean it, it may be possible using this CSV format the CSV format is a basic text format so it it, uh, it won't have any difficulty in uh, in case of supporting uh, uh, in different platforms okay there's a basic use of uh, this uh, CSV file so in this video we are going to create that using Java and I'll show you real-time uh, CSV file also okay so this is a sample CSV file as you can see so by default uh, uh, the CSV file uh, can be open in uh, Excel also okay so if you don't have Excel you can open that in a simple text format also you can see so I'll open it in my uh, Excel also and yes it uh, the CSV file has been opened in Excel as you can see uh, there are four different not uh, five different columns and uh, each column is having uh, some data in that okay so each column value is separated by a, a uh, comma value so this is the uh, CSV file in text format as you can see the heading book title comma uh, the book uh, book excel number this category name each is uh, separated by a comma and uh, by default this uh, the excel can differentiate that comma into different uh, columns like this okay yes now we are going to our eclipse at java eclipse ide where we will create a simple java project to create a sample csv file okay now in the project explorer i'm going to create a new uh, java project so select other and save as search as java you can see the java project just select next and i'm going to create the name as uh, create csv okay actually uh, this is my uh, java eclipse ide you, if you don't ha have your eclipse ide go to my videos i have another video how you can get an eclipse ide for your java developers okay so inside this i'm going to create a new package the package name i'm giving it as com dot chillyfax.com and inside that i'm going to create a class the class name i'm giving it as same the create csv okay csv so inside this we can create a main method so, uh, so first you have to create a print writer uh, print writer object so it's like uh, print print writer pw is equal to new print writer and inside this you have to create a new file so it will be like new file and you have to set the path of that file so the path of that file i am setting as so path i am setting this same folder so this is my desktop i'm copying the path pasting inside this and uh, change the single backslash to double backslash like this okay and now there is a chance of throwing exception yeah so we can add a try catch block here okay a try catch block and copy this inside to the try catch block and now we have to create a string builder object okay to be like a string builder not string buffer string builder sb equal to new string builder okay and now you can set the values for your uh, CSV file. So first value I'm giving it as uh, sb dot append, and inside that you have to set the value, the first value. So I'm the, setting the first value as uh, a cell number, 
and now after that I'm setting the second value as a book name and the third one as a category okay so I'm adding uh, till this one and I have to go to the next line so go to the next line is actually done as the backslash n okay now I'm copy pasting these all two times so there will be two rows for that so cell number I'm giving it as one book name one category name one and cell number two book name uh, as uh, two category two and it will be the uh, next line again okay now you have to write that uh, the string built into that file so it is uh, written we have uh, missed to set the name of the file so the file name i'm giving it as uh, books table okay dot csv and again we have to set our comma manually so there will be a comma between this category name and uh, this book name okay it will be like this copy it again paste it here no not here no need here actually so after the cell number there should be a comma and after the book name there should be a comma okay so here also again and same here here and here okay that's all and uh, now we can uh, wind up uh, the writing and the appending the values will be like pw dot write and inside that we can set the uh, the string builder uh, to a string actually to be like sb to string okay and now you can conclude it by closing the print writer it will be like this okay now check error is close okay now you can I'm just printing it as successfully finished okay yes that's all okay there is no need of any external API or something you can just write a simple Java text uh, simple Java program that's it so if I'm just running this one like this as a Java application it should be getting me the finished message and uh, the file should have created here yes the file has created if I am just opening that in my notepad you can see so the next line has uh, not come here so to to that yeah instead of a backslash n just uh, add backslash r also okay so backslash r backslash n will give it a new line like this now save it now we can uh, close this and just run it again now let's see again that in notepad file yes you can see the comma separate value has been created so if you am uh, just opening that in my uh, excel also you can see it is perfectly coming in and different columns and different cells okay so hope you got it this is how you can create a csv file using java so if you have any doubt in this please comment below i will be helping you i will uh, in my next video i will show you how we can uh, create a csv file of a mysql table uh, using java and save it externally in your pc okay so uh, please like and subscribe for my videos and thanks for watching